How many of you have had a dream before that you could not interpret? That's the spirit of revelation. Then the spirit of wisdom now gives you the interpretation. That's how you enter into understanding. Exactly. So I want to pray the prayer that Paul prayed for that church. I want to pray that prayer for you today. That the Lord will grant unto you the spirit of wisdom and of revelation in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ. The eyes of our understanding being and it shocked many people and yet many people were jubilant when the apostle made the proclamation that RCN is now a full-fledged church. There were two proclamations apostle made in a go. One, he said that from now henceforth he's going to stay in America for one year with his family. That's huge. Secondly, Apostle then let the cat out of the bag by declaring that RCN is now a church, especially the RCN in United States of America, and will be worshipping on Sunday morning. Wow, that's, that's a huge turnaround. God bless you. Now, just you now you get to hear that yourself no one could arrest her because light was not available the situation is not likely to change until we have a man like Daniel that fellowships in the realm of light deception dies once light comes someone can be masquerading to be your friend and the person is your enemy and the person will get by as long as you do not have access to the dimension of light The moment you can access the dimension of light, that which is concealed will be made what? Manifest. So light is one of the safeguards that God gives the believer so that you have power over deception. You see, and he said this light shines where? In our house. Still building my case because the real scripture my real scripture is here to come and building my case. I have um, about 20 minutes to finish building my case. So let's go to the book of uh, uh, Daniel chapter 5, if you're with me. Daniel chapter 5. This is the curriculum vitae of Daniel that has been read out in Daniel chapter 5 verse 11. These are the items on his CV. There is a man in thy kingdom in whom is the spirit of the holy gods and in the days of thy father what's the first thing light one understanding and wisdom like the wisdom of the gods that means daniel had the same or more capacity than a deity that is consulted are you with me you are not with me See, this is an unbeliever reading out the CV of Daniel. He doesn't know God. He said, this man has light like deities. The ones we consult, we throw huh? a human being. He has the capacity of a deity. He has wisdom. So there's no need to consult an altar belonging to a deity for inspiration if Daniel was present and the first thing that was mentioned that was operational on the life of Daniel and in the entire Bible I never saw that it was operational it was not written the way it was written in Daniel's case like this it was light because Daniel had light if you bring your ATM card to Daniel he can tell you the pin because light is that which makes manifest any man that has light it will be difficult for you to conceal anything from his eyes the Bible says in vain it's a snare set in the sight of a bed a man that has light can tell you the combination lock of your echo lock box because light is that which makes manifest you cannot hide anything from a man who has light so Daniel had access to the realm of light and a day came when all the sorcerers in the kingdom, the enchanters, the Chaldeans, the magicians were put to naught. Because a room of ancient strange writing appeared on the wall and sorcery could not decode it. 
witchcraft could not decode it stargazing and astrology could not decode it and when daniel came with light many many for light is that which makes what so this is the local assembly of houston so from henceforth this hub will be a local church and we'll meet every Sunday morning. When we go to California, we'll do the broad conference. Then we'll start Sunday morning in California too. When we go to New York, we'll do the broad conference. Then we'll start Sunday morning there too. All our current functioning platforms will be upgraded to local churches. Yeah. That's why I'm going to remain in the U.S. for one year until the upgrade takes place. Amen. <laughs> so, <laughs> my new mission field is North America. the least among our numbers shall become as strong as David. <laughs> when all the centers are upgraded, then sometime, maybe August next year, we'll now do the real general assembly. <laughs> and from that point, we will stand on the platform to say, thus said the Lord to America. What I have in mind is that everyone will begin to manage, like this number is small. But this number will become leaders, you manage yourself, it becomes a hub, then it becomes a platform. So I'm going to be there on my desk in the discipleship room for the upgrade, because some of the teachings, most of the places we rent to use for physical meetings are time dependent. So we'll be on Zoom, doing discipleship, doing prayer, doing adaptation. Until you have enough capacity to be able to stand your ground and become a burning lamp enough for people to gather around. We will do that until we penetrate every part of the United States of America. I don't know how many of you were careful to listen to Nigerian news yesterday. What, what you will find there is many, many take care who foresee. There's a writing on the wall, we need a man of light to interpret it. Anytime you see confusion, is many, many take care. And the sorcerers cannot read it. The wizards cannot decipher it. It is through the dimensions of light that our capacity of superiority will be revealed over witches and wizards. And if we are going to win the battle of America, it will be by light. Light and understanding and wisdom. Now, let us see the things that light did. Still talking about his CV. It was found in him whom the king Nebuchadnezzar, thy father, the king, I say, thy father, made master of the magicians. In the ministry of wisdom in Babylon, Daniel was the supervising minister. And under him were magicians and astrologers and Chaldeans and soothsayers. And when the unbelievers analyzed Daniel, they saw that the reason for his capacity was that there was an excellent spirit upon him and knowledge and understanding. So the light he had could make him interpret dreams. He could show hard sentences. He could dissolve doubts. Light. So Daniel had fellowship in the realm of light. Sometimes you might visit the doctors because you have a health condition and the doctors express their sincere ignorance of the condition. So even the doctor himself is devoid of light. So you will need to go back in search of the realm of light. Now there is a prophetic gift that God is giving someone in this auditorium. There's a prophetic gift. Now this gift is not the channel through which this gift will operate. It's dreams. 
and uh, God will exercise a commitment to this vessel in so much that many things that are about to happen will come to this individual it will come in volumes in torrents uh, that when you begin to document them it will fill up so many pages it's a prophetic stream it's a prophetic stream it's a stream of the prophets it's a stream of the prophets it's the stream of the prophets it's a stream of the prophets it's an opening in grace it's a stream of the prophets it's an opening in grace it's an opening in grace it's an opening in grace the stream of the prophets the stream of the prophets the stream of the prophets there is one among us that will begin to receive new songs the same stream will be delivering songs fresh songs new songs it will be a flow they continue from the presence of god we give you glory in the name of Jesus. Do you have, Pastor? Do you have any oil here? I need to anoint you to bring you into a position of favor. A position of favor. If you have oil, you do. Okay, let me let me borrow your oil. Is that oil? Looks like uh, the woman with oil come because she wants to lend me her oil. So, ah, huh? are you selling oil? <laughs> okay, the Lord, the Lord told you to bring three bottles. No, no, no. We are going to use that one because the Lord spoke. So you see, the Lord told her to buy three bottles. She she doesn't know that we'll be doing this. So the real the real oil is the Holy Ghost. So let's release. Normally, I like giving allowance for that ministry. So the angel of the Lord is here. It means that there's there's someone, there's someone that the hand of the Lord will come upon in the next uh, 12 seconds. This person, this person is receiving an advancement and enablement in the spirit. Yes, yes. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus Christ. Let the grace that is on this mission protect them from the onslaughts of the enemy. The Lord strengthen you with might by his spirit in your inner man. We bless you. We bless you. 
the Lord shine on you. May the Lord shine on you. In the name of Jesus. Now, you see, so, so, as I'm anointing them, the angel now is now anointing people. So, he's anointing, anointing people now. From my left-hand side to my right-hand side. Lord, let the anointing begin. Let it begin. So, you can stand up. Don't stand up until I give you my hand. So, go in this thy might. The peace of the Lord will be upon you. In the name of Jesus. As you can see, the Sabbath has not ended, but because we paid for this place for a limited period, we'll have to break. In fact, we're just starting. All right, go ahead and subscribe to this channel so you get notified anytime we release and post a captivating and useful content that will bless your life. We are here to serve you. God bless you. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Thank you. God bless you.